Inch. Well, you feel it? <laughs> I did. Now the yellow jackets are mad. <laughs> Good job, Jorge. One of the interesting aspects of using the demo dozer bucket is our ability to use it with our, our tree work. We do a lot of big removals, and as you can see here, uh, this, is, this is actually eucalyptus. And if you've ever worked with eucalyptus, you know that that's one of the heaviest woods there, there is. Each of these rounds weighs, I'm going to guess, at least 600 pounds, maybe 800 pounds. I know three of us could not stand one of these things up. It was that heavy. So it was either continually cut and cut and cut and get them down to little pieces or get the tractor out with this bucket and use it to load up the truck. One very interesting thing is how we can stack the rounds. Uh, we wanted to be able to put them up double so as you can see here we're putting one down on the bottom and very carefully putting another round on top of that one. Then once we have them somewhat stable, we're able to move the, bo the bobcat or the bucket back and um, push it and, and get it pushed all the way to the front of the truck. Sometimes we'll even go over and grab a long piece of uh, timber, say a 10 or 12 foot piece of timber and grab hold of that and use that to push wood around. But it's a very effective way of carefully loading up the truck and if you're, uh, if you're good with the tractor, you're not going to damage the truck while you're doing it. So it saved us an incredible amount of <laughs> hard work and, and saved our backs. But uh, I, I tell you, I, I'd be lost without this tool. I, I really, really think that you know, if you're in the tree business, you really ought to consider a skid steer. And if you're going to get the skid steer, you, you, you really got to get this bucket. Now there's a, a big difference between um, a typical uh, grapple bucket and the demo dozer bucket. If you notice that there's a nice long straight edge all the way along on both sides. And also notice that we're grabbing these big pieces of wood right on the very tip. Now if you had a grapple bucket with a point, you wouldn't uh, be able to control it very well because that piece of wood would be spinning all over the place. But because you have this long, stable uh, bar on the front, you can grab it and hold it very, very securely. Now look at that. We're, we're picking up a really heavy piece of wood. And the pressure, i, I got to tell you, the rams on this bucket are really strong. Um, you can, look at that. It's right on the very, very tips. And we're bouncing it around. All uh, right, it's, we're it's get really the old man an amazing the tool. Again guy hasn't been in a bobcat for a while. Let's see if he remembers how to use this truck, this tractor. Everything backwards for him. Oh, Oh, okay. Just gotcha. It gets stuck. 
Catch you.